they went that way. Home on the range Where the deer and yellow play Where seldom is heard A discouraging word Shut up! Alright, well then go to the clip And the sky is not cloudy all day <laughs> Well, how are you partners? Today I'm going to show you how to make the sounds of animal feet. Horse hooves and cats and dogs and mice and all kinds of critters. I'm going to introduce you to the ingredients you're going to need to make these sound effects. Get yourself a pair of leather gloves and some paper clips. Another useful item is finger picks for the guitar. If you can get yourself some coconut shells, then these are just the bottoms of toilet plungers. These haven't been used. And you might want to get yourself some replication of some dirt. You should have, um, a little beverage. Okay, we're going to start with the hooved animals, like horses and mules and donkeys. What a lot of people have been using for years are coconut shells. Or you can use real horse hooves if you got them. These are from a racehorse that, well, let's just say he didn't win for me. Here's an interesting fact. In the old days, when they used to do a horse of sound effects, for some reason they only did three hooves. Like this. Well, I guess that works if your horse has three hooves. But I like to do four. You should have, um... A little beverage. I'm using some kitty litter here to replicate dirt. Now I'm going to show you how to do those feet for those little critters. If you get those little guitar finger picky thingies, you put them on your fingers and you gently walk. If you get a pair of leather gloves and you tape some paper clips to them, you can get the same kind of effect. You should have, um, a little beverage. I'd like to thank Spigots the Cat Schwartzcaster for sending in this idea. And if you guys have any ideas or anything you want us to do here, leave it down below. And thanks for coming. Cheers!